Hi guys, we are literally traveling to the northernmost part of the world. It is located in the middle of Norway and middle of North Pole. It is a country ruled by nature. Come on! The flight usually takes four hours and then we have one hour melon landing or stopover in Tromsø before we're going to Svalbard as our final destination. See you guys! Passport control guy. We are going to take that plane going to Longyearbyen for about two hours. See you guys! Longyearbyen is the capital of Svalbard. Approximately, they have 3,000 people living here. 51 nationalities squeezed in a little space. And remember, you don't need visa to work here. Did you know that there is more polar bear here in Svalbard than the people living here? This land is owned by polar bear. The people here is just only a guess. So if polar bear wants to kill you, they can do it right away. Svalbard is a free land and they say it doesn't belong to anyone. But no, it belongs to the bears, the whales, the foxes. In the recent news, one Dutchman killed by polar bears. And that's the exact case. You are not allowed to go out alone in the vicinity of the city without any tour guide or without guns. Staying for three days in Svalbard, it made me realize that when you get driven to live your life in a place as pure as Svalbard, you may realize that it is really a real community, a true community where everyone takes care of one another. They love each other, and that is the true essence of full community. So, if you don't belong to the world out there, you don't belong like in Norway, or in the Philippines, or in Australia, maybe this is the place for you.